thank you Martin for those races we can't afford to chase this for you now to finish off this week from Charles Lee Corbett this is the members point two miles Temple of Buddha Derek Hinton Desco Inferno Matt Cooper Green Time Derek Hinton Independence Guru David Ladd Gazamali Alex Cherry Kenny Omega Matt Cooper Xenophone Salts and Clones Damage for Jamie Hopkins The I8 Runners in his first hand to a fall today for you uh, So they go towards the first of these fences I Just remind you that Derry Inton is the top trainer with six runners Six runners sorry at the moment he's too clear of a couple of trainers in behind him They jump in that one and Top trainers and uh, all in this, I think. Uh, Independence Gill and, and David are not one of the top trainers in the Enters field. I don't think he's had a win in the Enters yet. Disco Inferno is on the inside. A gap of three or four back to Temple of Buddha. And then Gazamali, Alex Cherry's runner. And then followed by Kenny and Mika Green Tight. And Xenophone Salots and Clowns, clowns, clowns damage is the back marker. The jump next, we well, jumped it safely. So they're heading towards the next fence and it's independence gear. gear. It leads by a few lengths from Disco Inferno in second. In third is Gazamali and then Green Tie and Temple of Buddha passing the post. Stick it in front of them then. And Independence Geary leads. Cable ends clear. Disco Inferno in second. Swing left hand it. Go out into the country. Again, and Independence Geary leads by three length. But Disco Inferno has been closed in on and jumped past by Green Tie. The one who didn't jump that one well was the Holly Sherry trained. Gazamali who hit it hard but he's, he's still in third we've got Mark Cooper's pair up outside of my Kenny Omega and Disco Inferno a jump in the ditch a bat pair still the Jamie Hopkins clones damage and sign of four insults there's a couple of lengths off him a jump in the next fence and that's a do so green tie has gone on by two lengths now for Independence Gear in second back in third is Disco Inferno and then in fourth is Kenny Omega Head towards the next fence They're jumping that one And independent skills come back on the inside of Green Tie Two lengths back to Desco in front of Gazamali And these are drawn away from the rest now Headed by Kenny Omega Although Temple of Buddha is trying to pick up But they're all clear the Jamie Hopkins pair as they head towards the next fence, they jump in that one and Independence Gear leads by a length and a half from in second place, Green Tie back in third on the inside, Disco in front of Gazamali in fourth and these four clear of Kenny Omega and Temple of Buddha is not getting any closer, they jump in that one I think they just got one more fence left, two more fences left to jump now and then towards the Independence Gear is, is well pleased, five, six times clear, can he keep it up, jump in this one we jumped that one fast and quick and so, Gazamali jumped it very slow, dropped from second to flip up towards the final fence. Nasty deals with interface, goes well clear at the moment, he jumps it well. Four, the final is clear of Disco Inferno is in second now. And his other still combining Kenny Omega stays on for third. Back in fourth is Gazamali, the Green Tide, Temple of Buddha. A long way clear of the Clarence Damage and Xenophone Salts. So, I'm waiting for the result there. And there it is. A win for Davy Lad. And that's that's his second winner in Dentist Chase. So he's at up to two. Disco Inferno second, Matt Cooper, Kenny Omega back in third, Gazamali and Green Tie.